Welcome to English Lingua Mastery. Improve your English level by listening to this story. This story includes vocabulary, expressions, and dialogues used in everyday English conversations. Replay it many times and try to repeat after the narrators to enhance your listening and speaking skills. Listen carefully. Sophie was overjoyed on the day of her graduation. Surrounded by her family and friends, she beamed with pride as she received her diploma with honors. After the ceremony, while mingling with the crowd of graduates and their relatives, she shared a moment of excitement with her best friend, Marie. I can't believe we finally made it, exclaimed Mary, clasping her friend's shoulder affectionately. All these years of hard work have finally paid off. Sophie nodded enthusiastically, a wide smile lighting up her face. It's true. Now it's time to take the next step, find the job of my dreams. Armed with her diploma and her determination, Sophie embarked on her job search with renewed zeal. She spent hours fine-tuning her resume, writing convincing cover letters, and browsing online job ads. She also attended job fairs, where she met recruiters and professionals from various industries. During an interview, Sophie shared her enthusiasm for the position with the recruiter. I am really passionate about this industry, and I am convinced that my skills and experience could be a valuable asset for your company, she says confidently. The recruiter nodded, impressed by Sophie's assurance. Thank you for your interest in our company, Sophie. We will keep you informed of the next steps in the recruitment process. Despite some rejections and moments of discouragement, Sophie did not let herself down. She knew that finding the right job would take time and perseverance. Each rejection was a lesson learned and an opportunity to improve. With each interview, she gained more confidence and experience, getting a little closer to her ultimate goal, to get her dream job. Sophie entered her new position with a mixture of excitement and nervousness. Although full of confidence in her abilities, she knew that the path to success would be fraught with difficulties. From the very first days, she was faced with challenges and obstacles that tested her resilience and determination. One of the first difficulties Sophie faced was the complexity of the tasks and processes in her new role. She often found herself overwhelmed by the amount of work and the speed of change. Despite this, she refused to let herself be overwhelmed. Whenever she faced an obstacle, she adopted a positive attitude and looked for ways to improve. Sophie was also aware of the importance of asking for help when it was necessary. She actively sought mentors within the company and more experienced colleagues who could offer her advice and guidance. Thanks to their wise advice, she learned to navigate the wheels of the company and to overcome challenges with confidence. Over time, Sophie began to notice an improvement in her performance. She had learned from her past mistakes and had developed new skills through her hard work and determination. She was more efficient at her job, more confident in her decision-making, and more resilient in the face of the challenges that presented themselves to her. I am so grateful to have had the opportunity to work in this company, she told her mentor during a coaching session. Every day, I feel like I'm learning something new and I'm growing as a professional. Her mentor smiled warmly at her. You have made incredible progress, Sophie. I am proud of everything you have accomplished so far and I know that you have a bright future ahead of you. Sophie's hard work and dedication did not go unnoticed by her superiors. One day, during a performance evaluation meeting, Sophie's manager praised her exceptional contributions to the team 
You really exceeded our expectations, Sophie, her manager said admiringly. Your hard work and dedication have been essential to our success. Sophie couldn't help but smile, feeling pride in her achievements. Thank you very much. It means a lot to me to hear that. She replied sincerely. Shortly after, Sophie received the news that she was looking forward to. She was promoted to a senior position within the company. With this new role came increased responsibilities and leadership opportunities, allowing Sophie to continue to grow and flourish in her career. As she celebrated this milestone with her colleagues, she couldn't help but feel excitement for the journey that awaited her. Sophie was faced with interpersonal challenges as she navigated office dynamics. Some of her relationships with her colleagues were sometimes tense, and she had to deal with power games and delicate office policies. One day, during a team meeting, Sophie found herself in disagreement with a colleague on the best approach to adopt for an important project. I think we should follow this method. It has given good results in the past. Sophie declared, expressing her point of view with confidence. His colleague raised his eyebrows, disagreeing. I'm not sure that this is the best option. Perhaps we should consider a different approach. He replied with a hint of skepticism. Sophie took a deep breath, reminding herself of the importance of communicating effectively and respectfully. I understand your point of view. Perhaps we could discuss our ideas and find a compromise that suits everyone. She proposed, seeking to resolve the conflict constructively. As Sophie climbed the corporate ladder, she found herself faced with the challenge of balancing her demanding career with her personal life. The long hours spent at the office were beginning to weigh on her and she realized that she had to take time for herself to avoid burnout. One evening, while returning home after an exhausting day, she received a call from her best friend, Marie. It's been forever since we haven't seen each other. We should meet for dinner one of these days, suggested Marie enthusiastically. Sophie felt guilty for neglecting her personal relationships in favor of her career. You're right. It would really please me to see you. I will try to find a moment in my busy schedule. She replied with sincerity. Determined to find a work-life balance, Sophie began to take steps to take care of herself. She began to exercise regularly, meditate, and devote time to her favorite hobbies. She realized that taking care of her well-being was essential to be successful in her career and fulfilled in her personal life. Sophie quickly understood the importance of having mentors in her company to help her progress in her career. She actively sought out more experienced people who could offer her sound advice and guidance. One day, during an informal lunch with a more experienced colleague, she shared her professional aspirations and challenges. I am impressed by your background, and I would really like to learn more from you, Sophie said humbly. Her colleague smiled warmly at her. I would be delighted to help you, Sophie. I have also had mentors who have helped me a lot in my career, and I am happy to be able to do the same for you. Thanks to her mentors, Sophie acquired valuable knowledge and unique perspectives on the business world. She learned to navigate the wheels of the company, overcome obstacles, and seize the opportunities that presented themselves to her. She felt grateful for their support and guidance, and she knew that they played an essential role in her personal and professional development. After years of hard work and determination, Sophie finally achieved success in her career. She had climbed the corporate ladder, achieved important goals, 
and achieved remarkable achievements. One day, during an annual review meeting, her manager congratulated her on her exceptional contributions to the company. Congratulations, Sophie. Your work has been remarkable this year, and we are all very proud of you. He said with admiration. Sophie smiled humbly, feeling a deep gratitude for the opportunities that had presented themselves to her. Thank you very much. It's an honor to be part of this team. She replied sincerely, as she celebrated her successes with her colleagues, Sophie recalled the challenges she had overcome and the sacrifices she had made to get to this point. She was proud of her achievements, but she remained humble and grateful for the people who had supported her along the way. She knew that the path to success was paved with challenges but she was ready to face any challenges that would come her way in the future. Thank you for watching. Remember, listening continuously is the key to mastering any language. Replay our stories anytime to boost your English skills. So keep those headphones on and listen. Whether during your day or while you sleep, practice makes perfect. If you like this way of learning, please subscribe and write your impression in the comments. See you next video.